the Yi 4K Plus is the evolution of the old model, the Yi 4K, you can watch that review to better understand the differences. Package and Build The Yi 4K Plus comes with a more complete package. In addition to the action cam, and the Type-C cable, we find a very nice waterproof case, which you can take up to 130 feet deep. The case is also equipped with a base with a standard bolt for a tripod. Functions and Quality The E4K 4K Plus is based on the new Amber LH2 chipset, with a quad-core ARM Cortex-A 5364-bit processor, which allows it to go up to 4K at 60fps. The sensor is a Sony IMX377 with 12 megapixels of resolution. Looks doesn't really change compared to the old one, just the front carbon fiber cover that makes it seem a little more aggressive, but for the rest it's the same action camera as before, at least on the outside. Videos are encoded in H.264 MP4, and go up to a maximum resolution of 4000 by 3000 pixels. In addition to photos and videos it is possible to shoot in time lapse up to 4K at 30 FPS, slow motion up to 720p at 240 FPS, photo burst, up to 10 poses per second, video plus photo, i.e. recording video and taking time lapse photos at the same time, and loop, a continuous video that lasts up to a maximum of 2 hours and then it overwrites itself, handy when used as a dash cam. And there's also a timer function. The touchscreen display on the back is still 2.2 inches wide, with a resolution of 640 by 360 pixels. It has a good brightness of 250 nits, and is readable outdoors, although not under direct sunlight. It has a fairly good responsiveness, albeit not perfect, and thus sometimes misses an input. Also present is the electronic image stabilization, an area where the old cam presented many flaws, and where this 4K Plus actually manages to justify the plus sign. The electronic image stabilization does not go beyond 4K at 30fps with a wide field of view. The user experience is exactly the same as with the old model, simple and snappy. Controlling the action cam via the display is very user-friendly, and the various menus are well designed and you will learn to navigate it in no time. Nothing to lament about the shooting modes, devices capable of recording in 4K at 60 frames per second are a rarity, and this 4K Plus doesn't skip a frame. Of course, definition and details are not always flawless. Color reproduction is quite faithful, maybe just with a slight tendency to cooler tones. In general, we were very satisfied with footage quality, which is the best one can ask of an action cam these days. The handling of areas with different contrast is also one of its selling points, having a dynamic range not easy to find in this size. As the sun goes down, however, issues start to creep in, not only in terms of noise and color reproduction, which turn to yellow. One could argue that action cams are not intended for use at night, but this is not necessarily obvious. The audio is also better, with the various microphones recording consistently from all directions, and providing a satisfactory result for this type of devices, although not the best. Battery life is also excellent. Shooting at 4K, if you do not have a large enough micro SD card, of 64GB, it is easy to run out of memory before running out of juice. App The app is exactly the same that has been with us since the first Ecamm, and has been developed over time. Pairing is fast and simple. Then there is the possibility to update the firmware of the action cam via the app, and this is perhaps the real reason that from time to time it might prompt you to use it. For the rest, the E4K Plus is completely self-reliant. The second reason to use the app is to use it as a viewfinder when you might not be able to take advantage of the action cam's display. The app provides you with all the control and options available on the action cam, with an interface designed for smartphones. You can switch between different shooting modes, adjust ISO settings, white balance, exposure, etc. and of course shoot and review content. Final Verdict The E4K Plus offers one of the best experiences we've ever had with an action cam. Powerful, thanks to 4K at 60fps shooting, easy to use, with a good app and good autonomy, and with a display that makes it completely independent of a smartphone in everyday use. In order to find a real flaw, you will have to dig deep starting with your pocket, because the price is high, although honest.